Hello guys, Oscar Hotel 8, Sierra Tango, November here from Survival Tech Nord. On the weekend of August 26th, I participated in an emergency communications exercise using WinLink. Well, that exercise got me thinking, is it actually possible to use QRP power to connect to a distant RMS gateway with a compromised antenna? Well, let's test it out and see. You are listening to the emergency broadcast systems. This station broadcasts emergency news and official information on the air for a sign area. So this first antenna is the Super Antenna MP1 DX Max kit. And we've configured it with uh, two MP1 antennas and their telescopic whips in a lazy L configuration. The horizontal element is beaming due south and the vertical element is at a 45 degree angle. We're using the 817 at 5 watts and we're connecting to Hotel Bravo 9 Alpha Kilo. Naturally conditions play a big part in this, but at 5 watts with the compromise antenna to a station that's nearly 2,000 kilometers away, we have a good solid connection. So I was able to maintain that connection and see if I had any messages on the server waiting for me. So rock and roll, solid connection, everything is working. Huge shout out to Bonnie, Kilo Quebec 6, X-Ray Alpha, who told me about this Lazy L configuration. Now we're going to move over and try the same thing with the Chameleon F-Loop 2.0. It's beaming 210 degrees south, and we're using the FT817 at 5 watts with no external amplifier. So once again, we have a good solid connection with Hotel Bravo 9 Alpha Kilo. And as I said with the first test, of course propagation plays a part in this. However, there are some things we can do as operators to improve our chances of making a solid connection with a compromised antenna. So the most clever amongst you will already have noticed one feature between both of these antennas. And that is, they're both almost directly beaming at Hotel Bravo 9 Alpha Kilo. So rather than wasting all of our signal in various directions, we're focusing it in the direction of the station we want to operate. Don't worry guys, we're going to be doing a lot more with WinLink and Automatic Link Exchange. For now, I'll say many thanks for the channel support. If you like what I'm doing, please give me a thumbs up. Share this video with someone or somewhere who might like what we're doing. Rock and roll, guys. Thanks for watching. Ciao.